Hey guys and welcome back to another how to tutorial and today I'm going to show you how you can make this really cool food truck. So guys stay tuned and I'm going to show you how you can make it. Right guys to make this really cool food truck we are going to need all the blocks that you can see right in front of me. We are going to need stone brick slabs, quartz blocks, quartz stairs, black stained glass, black stained glass panes, buttons, coal blocks, string, furnaces, levers, white carpet, iron doors, red carpet, red concrete and paintings. Now once you have all of these blocks guys we then need to find an area of where we want to build our food truck. Now once you've found the area of where you want to build it the first thing we need to do is grab our coal block and place it down where we want our tire to be. So this is going to be our first tire to our food truck. Then we're going to grab our stone brick and we're going to place an upside down slab on this side and then we're going to place six upside down slabs on this side. So one, two, three, four, five, six, just like that. Then we're going to place another tire next to it like this and then we're going to place one more slab at the end. Now this is going to be the front over here guys and this is going to be the back just like this. So what we're going to do is extend this out to the other side. So we're going to extend it out by two slabs all the way across. So just go all the way to the other side just like this and then where we have the tires on the other side we're going to match it on this side. So there's a tire there so I want to put one here and then we're going to finally do it on this side as well and put it uh, opposite that other tire right there. So this is going to be the base to our food truck. Now once we have the base all set guys what we need to do is grab ourselves some quartz blocks. Now we're going to put a quartz block on the left hand side right here. Then we're going to grab an upside down stair and place it right there. Then we're going to get our quartz blocks once again and build all the way across until we get to the next tire and we're going to do an upside down quartz stair like that and then do the same on this side right here. But this time what we're going to do we're going to go around to the other side and do the exact same thing. So blocks all the way across apart from uh, above the tires and then right above the tires we're going to put upside down quartz stairs. Now at the back we're going to leave this space empty and we're also going to leave this space empty at the front. But what we're going to do now is start working on the side so we can see the general shape of our food truck. So for the side what we're going to do is place two glass blocks like this and then we're going to get a piece of red concrete and place it there. Then we're going to leave a four block gap in the middle. So one, two, three, four. Then we're going to place three pieces of red concrete at the end right there. We're going to do the same on this side but we're not going to leave a gap in the middle. So we're going to get red concrete and do it all the way across and we're going to stop right there. Then we're going to get our black stained glass blocks, put it across and put it at the front. So this is going to be the windscreen for our truck. Now in this gap at the front right here we're going to put a furnace so it looks like the engine for the truck and we're going to go back around to the front and at the back as well we're going to also put an iron door. So just slowly building it up just like this. Now for the roof what we're going to do, we're going to do something a little bit more complicated but it should be quite easy to follow. We're going to go to the front of our truck and we're going to grab some quartz stairs and we're going to place a quartz stair there. Then we're going to turn to the side, place a quartz stair there and place in that one on the other side as well. Then we're going to go to the back of this stair like that and place it there so it makes this shape that as you can see right here and place another one right there. Then in the middle we're going to put a quartz block. Then we're going to get quartz block and place it all the way across the side just like this and then we're going to leave a one block gap at the end and we're going to do the same on this side as well all the way across like this leaving a one block gap and then at this block gap at the end we're going to put three stairs like that. So as you can see guys it's starting to take shape and it's starting to look like a truck. Now for the roof right here what we're going to do we're going to grab ourselves some slabs and we're just going to do a little bit of a pattern at the top right here. So what I'm going to do is put a slab right there in the middle and then I'm going to bring this out one more like that and then I'm going to bring it to the front and to the other side like this and then we're going to go across uh, four blocks or, or three more blocks so it's four blocks in total so this is number one two three four like that and we're going to do the same on this side bring it across like that and then place one more slab on the end like this so we're just making this little shape just to make it look a little bit more interesting now we can fill this up and then fill this space at the back here with our quartz blocks so as you can see guys we've got the main frame to to our food truck complete. So what we need to do now is spice it up a little bit and add some extra detail to it to make it look a little bit more realistic. So what we're going to do first is grab our, our stained glass panes and place a stained glass pane there and there just to add that detail at the front to look like wing mirrors. We're also going to grab ourselves some levers, some buttons and some pieces of carpet like this and some string. Then we're going to put a, a lever on this side right here. No, that's a button. We're going to put a lever right here and a lever right here. Then we're going to grab our string and we're going to place 
it next to this lever. So you might need to hold crouch or shift. I'm going to place it right there. And we're going to go all the way across until we get to the other lever right there. Then we're going to grab our carpet and we're going to alternate between red and white carpet. So we're going to put red carpet on top of this lever. Then we're going to put white carpet, then red then white, then red, then white until we get to the end. So it looks like a little audience above where you would buy the food in a food truck. Next, what we're going to do is put some buttons on our wheels so it looks a little bit more realistic. So they look like tires. We're going to do that on both sides. And then at the front right here, we're going to add a little bit of extra detail. We're going to grab ourselves a painting and some signs and we're going to put a painting here. Um, you can choose whatever painting you want. I've got a mod installed, so it gives me the, my painting selection. But what I recommend is that you choose the same painting on each side so place two paintings in the middle and make sure they are exactly the same just so it looks like pictures of food or something like that then you can put a sign on this side and a sign on this side actually I think there is a painting of food isn't there I think this one looks like food there we go we're gonna select that one instead so it actually looks like food and they're selling food inside of the food truck so guys that is the main frame of the food truck complete so you can leave it like that if you want to or we can have add even more extra detail to the outside so what I'm gonna do at the front of this food truck area I think I'm gonna add a place where people can eat so I'm gonna grab myself a fence and I'm just gonna put a little table down here just gonna add maybe a table around this area here then put a piece of carpet it on top then grab my string put it all the way around that piece of carpet on the floor like that and then place more carpet on top of it so we have like a nice little table where people can eat we can also grab ourselves some quartz stairs and place it underneath the table so people can sit down and actually eat something if they want to so they've got like a nice table outside of the food truck and over here I think I'm just going to add a nice little umbrella which is very very simple to do just grab yourself some fences build it up two or three blocks like this I'm going to build it up four blocks and then underneath this top block right here what we're going to do is build like a little square all the way around the fence then once we have done that what we're going to do is, is a nice little trick with some beds you can grab any color bed that you want and we're going to place our bed all the way around just like this to make a little umbrella and then we're going to put a slab in the middle like that and then we can destroy the blocks that we placed underneath and if you want to you can place some chairs underneath the umbrella so people can just chill and eat their food underneath the umbrella if they want to but there we go guys we have a really simple and cool looking food truck that you can put in any of your minecraft worlds but guys, if you enjoyed this tutorial and you want to see more just like this and you never want to miss an upload from me, all you need to do is click on the little bell symbol next to the subscribe button and you will be notified every time I upload a brand new tutorial. But thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it and I will see you again in another how-to tutorial.